I had everyone pick out just the, the two categories for the official Shrimp Hours Drippies 2023. The best and the worst. That's it. Um, I've got 15 of the worst cars and 15 of the best cars. And uh, we're basically going to pick through them, probably whittle it down to like a, a final selection and then award the uh, the Drippies to the, to the best and the Drownies to, <laughs> to the worst. <laughs> um, I've considered... Uh, just all the Cup Series and Xfinity and Trucks from this season, but... Can can we award the uh, Drowny just to uh, the driver and the designer? Just throw them in a fucking river. Yeah. <laughs> um, throw them in Lake we, Erie. I got a question. Do we start with the best or do we start with the worst? I think we start with the best because... I'm yeah, thinking so neg too. Yeah, negativity yeah. sells. Let's just save that for the end. Right, yeah. okay. So the... Official nominations for the best paint schemes of the year 2023. Wait, did me or Caleb get any uh, selections on this one? I literally asked You've you guys. You've been in the call for like 30 minutes. And no one sent anything except for Ben. I, I, I did sent, the rest of the selections two. myself. It, it's right. true. Okay, okay. I gave two. <laughs> Rusty, you literally had an opportunity. I Okay, specifically... I'm going to read mine off. Ryan Blaney, Daytona 500. All Ryan right, Blaney, auto All right. Uh, anyway, the best cars. We got the Brad Castrol Edge uh, six car, which is hot. Um, I this is a sleeper pick. The Eric Almirola Go Bowling Machine. I know he ran this last year, but this thing's hot. Uh, the Justin Haley Tide Ride from Bristol Dirt Race, super cute. Um, the Brad Prez uh, uh, Rocket Bread car. What do you call this? Bread Rocket. The Bone Steel Aerospace. Bone Steel machine. Aerospace. Unfortunately, Ty Gibbs made the list because his Interstate 54 with the little monster thing is really hot. The red numbers, yes. Somebody finally uh, did it. This Tanner, Tanner Gray friggin' Sunset thing. Um, BJ McLeod's Blaster car, which I think this one, was it like a NASCAR and NBC Twitter poll for like best paint scheme? The BJ McLeod Blaster car nut, one, so that's on the blaster. list. Um, the Priest Wonder Bread. Uh, now, a random... are we counting throwbacks or are we not th counting throwbacks? We are. Uh, Riley Herbst, Sunny D, which I also is kind of a sleeper pick. Uh, the Yahoo Purple Car, Seabell. I ran that last year as well. Here? What? These are sick. Oh my god. Um, DT wanted it. Justin Haley Mountain Dew. These are all DT. <laughs> no, this is Ben. The Bill Byron, Jeff Gordon, friggin' copper throwback thing. Oh, that was great. Oh. Uh, Rocket League Reddick. <laughs> I'm biased though. I'm All guy Reese's yes. and uh, the Josh Berry High Rock vodka. Those mm. are your picks. Uh, is there anything you want to cross off the list immediately? Eric uh, Almirola, Avila. the William Damn. Byron. Ty yeah, I'm also, I'm also crossing off William Byron. You, you think the? I guess it's not the best, but that red number interstate thing is pretty sick. I think yeah, it's, not, uh, it's not the best, but it's pretty good. I Eric think Jones. We know the winner. You think you know the winner, Rusty? Absolutely. As far as like all four of us voting right now, I think we know the answer. I like the Rocket League car, but it's not the best. Same with the High Rock. The get Reese's might the, be the best the Xfinity truck. car. Uh, the truck's I'm going to run the Reese's. Put that, put that, that the back on one. there. That's the best I think that's one. the oh. <laughs> Okay. 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 I like the Get blaster car as but well. I really don't like the number and like it's not that good. The hood Get is rid of sick. Blaster, but the Get rid of just okay. Get rid of Brad. No, 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 no. I, I, all right. We're getting into the stiff Dude. competition now. Yeah, we got the Castrol uh, Edge Brad car, the Tide Ride, the Mountain Dew, Sunny D, the Bread Rocket, and Reese's. And you guys are pushing I'll, I'll for be, Reese's I'll, as I'll the best. Be honest, those two thirty ones. One of those got to be it. I'm leaning towards Mountain Dew. Dude, that Mountain Dew car is so sick. My vote is Mountain Dew as well. For best? Yep. I like the Reese's car. It's sick, but I would say it's maybe the best Xfinity car, but not better than the Mountain Dew 31 or the Tide Ride. Tide Ride's sick, too. God. Rusty, what do you think? I go seven car clean sweep across every category. There's two categories and it's best and worst. I don't know how that works. But <laughs> I would honestly say it's between the Brad Castrol 6 and the Haley Mountain Dew car. No, I say it's between the Justin Allgaier, Reese's, and then uh, the Mountain Dew car. 
That's fair. Damn. But best merch of the year, uh, as far as like total line of uh, items, would probably go to the uh, the bread mobile. Yeah. 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 I got a t shirt. There were some I, sick Dell Jr. I shirts, might, too. I might throw in a tiebreaker. The Reese's car shows the actual product. That's the yeah, best but you're not going to put a can of Mountain Dew on it. Yeah, why not? That is fair. Why not? Because you know what Mountain Dew is. Like, the design, it's all friggin' sharp and angry. Yeah, it's, it's, got like, all it's like nonsense. neon green poison. We already have that on the court. Putting a little right? round can on that would, like, genuinely make it worse. Not worse than that yellow number. <laughs> like, hope. yeah, yeah. If that had a red roof number, it it might just take it automatically. Mm. I'm gonna go Mountain Dew, honestly. Yeah, I'm gonna stick with Mountain Dew. Rusty, you're saying Reese's? Yeah, yeah. Flat? Because there, if if the seven car had contigs, I would say it was a tie. But they just don't have enough contigs to make that work. You could tell that was meant for like contigs and all that stuff yeah. on the side. If it was yeah. filled out. Like, if that came out 10 years ago... One of the things that does it for me, despite how, like, cute it is with the big Reese's logo, I don't like how far forward the number is. Like, it's a little bit... slid it forward on the roof and the door. It's a little bit too forward. Like, it's just uncomfortable enough. I think it should be more, like, there. But it's a valiant effort. Uh, congratulations, uh, Justin Haley, friggin' Mountain Dew machine. I forget who, who designed design this. this. I did, but I forget. I it's getting to the point where I'm losing track of paint scheme designers. Like there are too many. Uh, oh, fuck, I forget who did this, but he's sick, and it was his first cup car. Um, so we're we're in for some some good things to come if he gets more of them. Dude, I love how the Mountain Dew logo like wraps all the way around the hood across the fucking fenders. Yep. Oh my god. I mean, even even the little Food City logo on the quarter panel still looks pretty good. Yeah, yeah it fits. So it's officially time to pick the worst. The now drownies. We've, we've found the uh, the the one that made it to the top of the pile of the uh, the drippies. Yeah. Welcome to the 15 worst paint schemes of the 2023 season. They're all Cup Series cars, and like half of them are Stuart Haas. So let's get to it. Um, some of these are, a lot of these are my picks. The Kevin Harvick plain white mobile one car that just has it's nothing plain, on but it. It's not the worst. Yeah, and then the one where they made it even worse by putting this oh. like gray <laughs> yeah, stuff on yeah, it. Yeah, it <laughs> ran at Sonoma. <laughs> um, the Briscoe vacation planner car where you can't no, read anything on. from a distance. Yeah, this thing's garbage. It's not as um, bad as a snap on. That's true. The Alex Bowman Detroit Pistons with the purple and the blue and the that thing on the Detroit. nose. Detroit. Also, the front numbers are pink. <laughs> so is the logo on the side. It's it's pink and purple and red and blue and white at the same time. It's gross. Uh, this this uh, this is an early pick for taking moldy it. Bread. The, the Stenhouse moldy bread car from Talladega. The Stenhouse. Reese's car where it's just plain orange with a completely blue hood. I think that's um, fine. I like this because I like ben, that orange of the Reese's. Ben made the selection for the best and I made the selection for the worst so I put it in the worst. Is that just a plain... It's just an orange car with a blue hood, man. Uh, the Hosovar white on light blue with the just gradient resort on the side. Pretty gross. Uh, shit. The Harvick Harvick car, uh, just because they sent him out in that turd. Uh, the uh, <laughs> I forgot about this one. <laughs> the Almirola IHOP half Smithfield thing. <laughs> I kind of like it. We've talked about extensively on this program. The Byron Pods car. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Rusty wanted to pick the Gregson Baconator machine for Wait, the best. This is not bad. Why is this on the worst? I think it's the sucks. bacon racing stripes. You don't like the bacon racing no. stripes? You it fucking even has the on, on there. there. You fucking <laughs> communist. Get the fuck out of here. All right. <laughs> Throw uh, yourself off the Canadian bridge into America. Throw yourself off into Niagara Falls. The uh, the Bubba Wallace gunmetal gray McDonald's car for some reason. Uh, the Bubba Wallace <laughs> DoorDash <laughs> sad machine. 
uh, the Bubba Wallace Columbia uh, moon car. I don't know what to call it is. I don't know what's going on there. And the, St <laughs> the Stenhouse Coke Zero Sugar with black logos on a dark Why red Why couldn't car. they just make that white? It's, yeah, it's tough. Okay, is there anything on this list that is not the worst? I'm uh, taking off the plane. White right cars. Uh, Dude, I don't uh, know. Uh, yeah, 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 get that out bad. of there. You think this isn't the worst? No, that 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 can stay. That can stay. Get rid of the oh, Reese's okay. one. <sighs> the get Reese's rid of the Bubba McDonald's. That one's a good one. Okay. No, it's it's not. But I will. Yeah, I'm gonna go. get rid of IHOP as it's well. It's not even the worst. Still ugly. I kind of like the IHOP car. Yeah. Okay. So then it's not in the worst. The Harvard car is like sad, but it's not like itself an ugly car. This it's is just, just kinda... like a retread of something else they did anyway. Yeah, yeah. which is kind of dumb. Um, this the Columbia Moon car is like kind of ugly, but it's also it also has this little chrome gold stuff. Oh. Like part of, the, part of the reason I selected this was how it appeared on TV. It was just a big blob, and you couldn't make yeah, you out just couldn't see it on fair. TV. Yeah. That's fair, but I also think this DoorDash car is worse. Yeah, uh, I think that DoorDash car is worse. Therefore, yeah. Columbia is not the worst. Also, the Pods car is pretty bad, and you can't read the number, but it's not that bad. Like they have a big logo on this side, at least. Uh, yeah. And I'm throwing out the Coke Zero Sugar car only because the moldy bread car is worse. <laughs> So we're down to six. We got the Vacation 14. The, get, the, get the Vacation the 14. It, it's not that bad. It's just you can't read the fucking sponsor. Yeah. yeah. The the Pistons car is pretty gross, but it's not all that bad. It's just no, the no, 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 no. Bring it back. Bring it back. Bring it all right, back. All right. All right. <laughs> the number and the fucking logos are not the right they don't match the rest of the scheme. That is like unforgivable. There's like pink and purple in there with like the yeah. Detroit Pistons, red, white, and blue. Yeah, it's pretty gross. Also, it's getting worse by the day by the amount of losses Detroit has. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's true. I guess that's what happens when you get put on an Alex Bowman car. <laughs> as much it, as I should to hate me, to say it, is it down but... between the 48 and the 47. That's what it comes down to. Uh, this, this Harvick car is pretty bad. Like it it's is bad, pretty, but it's not it worse than the other ones. This yeah. is a decent photograph, and I still can't read what it says on the side. <laughs> but you can read Mobile what it says on the hood. Something, yeah. Okay. That, also, that is third worst, but it's not the worst. The host of our sudden secret car is pretty bad, but it's not the worst. But it pops on the track, and it's not like off. Yeah, except you can't read it. Like, look from this distance, you have no idea what any of that says. <laughs> it's the worst as far as uh, sponsorship. I think there's a clear winner here. Unfortunately, I think so as well. Detroit Pistons. No, it's bad. <laughs> mine's, mine's artisanal. But the, the Artisano 47, what or really gets Artisano. me is that they have a logo hidden on the quarter panel and then a, a piece of bread for the quarter panel logo, which isn't the same kind of bread as the other piece of bread for the main sponsor, which is also just moldy and all over the car. Hold on. I, there is one thing to save it. I think there's, I see what you see. There's grilled cheese on the quarter panel. Yeah, but that's not... It's the wrong bread. It's a different it I don't wrong care, bread. dude. It's grilled cheese. I can't... I can't... I can't drown grilled cheese. Yeah, but that, it's literally from another car. Like, it's from the country croc car, and they just slapped it on the quarter panel. Here. Based. <laughs> that's... this. The fact that they, they wrapped even the skirts with the bread... See, also I think skirts based. is actually a good thing because they wrap the skirts. This might be the most disgusting car in uh, a while. We, like, we need to put it to a vote, though. Like, I'm going to do that in the, the lines. Artisano uh, bread tomorrow just to make a fucking point. It is actually good bread, but man, that car is tough. Okay, Rusty, what do you think? Well, which one's worse? Think, Pistons or bread? I think I can settle this in okay. one simple statement. Okay. There's been a certain team. Well, <laughs> now that I think about it, it could qualify for both teams. There's a certain organization that consistently puts out the worst 
body of work and it is the flagship team in nascar yeah. over decades every employee on that team needs to be drowned because of the stuff they show up at the track with i'm going the 48 car they're getting drowned they gotta go see i i agree with you that they should drown but i don't think it's over this car like this is no they rust, rusty, rusty, rusty some bring, crime rusty brings up a good point the 47 team has all these sponsorship deals with all these different like uh, brands and stuff through Kroger. They're mm -hmm. going to put out some drowns. They're going to miss and they're going to miss pretty hard sometimes because they, they put out a different car every, every day. This is a good point. Ally actually. and fucking Hendrick do not have that excuse. The allies on that car every single week. And it looks yep. like a piece of shit every single <laughs> week. <laughs> You know All what? Right. My mind has been changed. It's been decided. <laughs> there it is. The there 2023 is. drowning. <laughs> I'm coming in a little toxic from today's 24 Rust, car Rusty news. So get him out of here. His based arc. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna get some emails about this because I know there's some weirdos that like this car, but How, but dude, it's the purple, the pink, like the fact that you can fix just this. Make it red, white, and blue. Yeah. It was so easy. The fact that you can fix this in five seconds and no one ever bothered to do so is like I could fix this in MS to the drowning with the fucking paint bucket tool in like five <laughs> seconds. The pistons being absolute dog shit doesn't help me. <laughs> I'm just gonna treat it like a lifetime achievement where where you piss me off long enough with some garbage, you're you're going down. You gotta go. Uh, I do have a bonus entry for drip. This might be the non-NASCAR drippy of the season. And that's the uh, the oh, Pizza Hut Ninja oh, Turtles yeah. oh my God. Macaulay and the Jones suit. car. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God. I don't have the picture of it uh, on hand, but he has the helmet too with the freaking uh, Ninja Turtles thing. They even took the picture in a sewer. <laughs> yeah, that's the best part. They literally <laughs> found a sewer tunnel and put the car in it to take the picture. Banger. All right, thank you. Uh, no and one apologies. Out peaches the hut. Uh, no one is still listening on audio platforms. Unless they you taste left. it. Um, but that that is your dripper drown finale. Uh, tune in next week when we talk about those garbage Hendrick cars that they put out today. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs>